Since Medwick Council became one of the few authorities in England to carry out weekly recycling collections, local people are doing their bit to help the environment. In fact, householders are recycling 27% more rubbish than they did before the weekly collections began. Medway has an extensive recycling service. Paper and card should be separated from glass bottles, tin cans and plastics, and food and garden waste should be placed in brown wheelie bins. These separated materials can then be reused over and over again. Items put in black sacks, however, don't get recycled and will be burned or go to landfill. So the aim is to reduce the number of black sacks we put out and recycle as much as possible. Waste disposal company Veolia collects all rubbish on behalf of Medway Council and their 140 members of staff in 46 trucks work hard to keep the streets clean and clear. Different trucks are responsible for collecting different types of waste. Some are dedicated to collecting your black sack waste and you'll see others collecting your recycling. They're the ones with the special trucks with two compartments, the narrow side for paper and card and the other for glass, cans and plastics. The trucks are emptied at a centre on the Medway City Estate and recycled contents is transported to special processing facilities in Kent, London and Essex. Black sack rubbish that goes to landfill is twice as expensive for the council to dispose of. So we've seen how rubbish is collected in Medway, but how good are we at separating our waste to be recycled? Um, now we're doing very well in Medway in terms of recycling. We're recycling um, now over 40% of our waste. Um, but we can still do more and you can see from that large pile of black sacks uh, that a lot of that, that material can go on the other side of the shed. Um, if people just a little bit more diligence in separating out their materials, making sure their food waste goes into their brown bin, they separate out that paper and their plastics and cans and glass go into their white bag or clear uh, recycling sack. If it goes into the black sack that's either going to be landfilled or it's going to be uh, incinerated for energy. And that's it. Those resources are then lost forever. And it's a very expensive way of dealing with waste. However, on the other side of the shed, there's, there's about 50% saving in the cost of dealing with that waste. And it can go back into products. It can go back into industry. The organics, the food and the garden waste, that can be composted and that can be spread on Kent farms. The paper can predominantly stay in the UK. The plastics can be made into new plastic items, metals into new metal items, and the glass can be turned into new glass. So that, that's where we want it. So really, you know, residents can play their part by just spending that time and separating out their, their, their waste so we can collect it in that format and then we can deal with it in the most efficiently way possible. So what do Medway residents think of the service? absolutely first class and the guys that collect it are very polite always very cheerful always a good morning with a smile they never moan they do their job they're always moving they don't stop to find out more about how to recycle effectively visit www.medway.gov.uk forward slash recycle